Hey everyone, Gio here from Fandom United, back to talk about Deadpool 3. There are some exciting updates with this movie, and I can't wait to talk about it with you guys. So spoilers ahead, potential spoilers for Deadpool 3. This information comes from a couple sources I trust, including the Cosmic Wonder, My Time to Shine Hello, as well as a uh, scooper from The Wrap. So the first bit of information should be good news for everybody, and that is we know where Deadpool 3 takes place. It will be the last movie in Phase 5, and that means this movie could be also getting pushed up from its September 2024 release, and we know that production is going to be beginning soon, on this movie, Hugh Jackman has been just getting ripped in the gym, getting back into Wolverine shape. Another bit of news that was revealed is that Phase 6 will be where the multiverse begins to fall apart. And it's because of what's happening in Deadpool 3. The reports are saying that Deadpool is going to be using his time travel device that he used in a previous movie to go to different timelines, universes, and pull characters out of that universe two characters in particular that are mentioned sir patrick stewart's charles xavier and sir ian mckellen's magneto those two will be returning and making their well charles xavier already made his debut in the mcu i guess a variant in multiverse of madness and the reports are saying they're not going to be a part of just deadpool 3 but also secret wars and that makes all the sense given the story you're going to be seeing a lot of characters from the Fox universe, probably characters like Wesley Snipes' Blade making a return and, um, you know, the Fantastic Four, all that characters coming together to fight all these variants of Kang that we saw in the Council of Kangs in a post credit scene in Quantumania. Furthermore, we've heard from one of the actors themselves, Sir Patrick Stewart, talk about this. And it was more of a tease when he said, we're not done, Sir Ian and myself. We've got plans. Now, on one hand, I'm very excited to see these two OGs interact with Deadpool, a character like Deadpool. I mean, <laughs> that's just... Talk about throwing an underhand pitch for just comedic gold right there. I can't wait to see those interactions. On the other hand, I am just not as hyped up in regards to... Professor X's return, okay? I feel like it should be a bigger deal. But unfortunately, we did see the character in Multiverse of Madness get killed off a decision that I did not like because I thought it took away from having Professor Xavier in the MCU. Now, Sir Ian McKellen's Magneto, I'm excited to see him back. We haven't seen the two of them together on screen since Days of Future Past, which I would argue was a fitting send-off to these two characters. This also makes me wonder, how will Wolverine react to seeing uh, Professor X and Magneto? Okay, like, this has to be a variant of Wolverine. It, this can't be the same one from Logan, okay, which now we know takes place in 2029. So this has to be a variant it's probably going to butt heads with Magneto, okay? But again, I don't think it'll be the same uh, Magneto. It'll, again, Deadpool is pulling from multiple universes. It'll be very interesting to see how this all plays out. Expect Deadpool 3 to be released a little bit sooner. Uh, expect it to end Phase 5 and cause a lot of havoc for Multiverse Saga with all these incursions in the form of Deadpool pulling characters from their universes a whole lot of exciting stuff deadpool 3 only getting bigger and bigger expect the ogs and professor x and magneto to be making a return not just for deadpool 3 but also secret wars expect to see toby mcguire's spider-man in secret wars expect to see hugh jackman's wolverine in secret wars and a whole lot of more characters guys the more i find out the more i'll come to you guys and relay this information and just talk about it because that's what we love to do here at Phantom United, you know, we don't worry too much about spoilers because, you know, it's it's been proven time and time again that, you know, we can go into a movie knowing things, but still be just as odd and surprised and, you know, just happy to see these things play out on a big screen. 
we're seeing it with the last of us and everyone who played the video game still love it and so here we talk about rumors and all this good stuff and that's gonna do it my name is geo from fandom united thank you so much for joining me in this video until the next video you guys take care